Hello there. Thanks a lot for coming by PosterCentral.com's video blog today. I'm Pete Howard, and today I've got a couple of really offbeat, fun, different, but very timely examples of vintage posters from Wes Wilson, the absolute dean of psychedelic concert poster art. After all, he's the man who designed 45 out of the first 50 Bill Graham concert posters and the first 10 Family Dog concert posters. And that, of course, was starting in the winter of 1966. So here you've got a couple of lovely but non-concert posters, definitely psychedelic, from the fall of 1966 in San Francisco. And how appropriate to start off with the one that uh, is a poster advertising a rock and roll poster exhibition. How cool and appropriate is that? Well, that's exactly what we have here in striking red and purple colors. Notice how Wes's artwork shows this, you know, some kind of nude goddess with an Egyptian headdress that flows down and out of the frame. And she's holding a snake. And, whoops, very interesting, there's a big 1966 there in the upper right. And then coming in on the words, in Wes's highly stylized writing there, the red on the purple, it does say, Rock and Roll Poster Exhibition, San Francisco. And then below that, Art Institute Gallery, 800 Chestnut Street, November 2 through 28. Now that venue is definitely significant. I mean, the Art Institute Gallery that was founded in 1871 and is the oldest art school west of the Mississippi, but even more interesting in rock circles, among the many musicians who studied there at this time was the Grateful Dead's Jerry Garcia. I'd like to point out here, on the woman's thigh, that is where Wes chose to sign his artwork. Right there, I can get in close on that. So just to show you now what, you know, Wes was doing for Bill Graham at the time and to show you the similarities, I have an image here, not the actual poster, but all we need is the image, of the one he did in the middle of this month, in the middle of November, and that would be BG38 for The Grateful Dead at the Fillmore. And boy, take a look at those similarities, would you? Just amazing. you got the flowing figure on the left, you know, and you got the same style lettering on the right. And uh, just no question these two were cut from the same cloth at the same time. <laughs> okay, so let's look at our second non-concert Wes Wilson psychedelic concert poster from the very next month in December. Boy, look at this beauty, huh? And it's for Levi Strauss jeans. Wow, what a marvelous blending of silver, light blue, gray, and black. Boy, I'll tell you. By the way, I should have mentioned both of these are larger than a standard Fillmore poster, 14 by 20. These are both 16 plus by 24 inches plus, so they take up some nice real estate. So this poster was made to commemorate, rather than advertise, the retirement of 15 employees from Levi Strauss and Company and they're all named on the poster, so perhaps they all kept one, hopefully so. But the poster's dominated by this big image of a handsome, man, handsome man's face and a long philosophical quote, let me get in somewhat closer here, that Mr. Wilson came up with himself. And by the way, I did confirm that with the family before saying that, I wanted to be sure. And that quote says, We dream of a time when knowledge comes of age to show us a beginning which has no ending. Very nice. And then you've got all the particulars for the event down there in the lower right hand corner. As you can see, 15 employees all named on there. And below that it says, at the World Trade Club in the Ferry Building, San Francisco, on December 10th, 1966. And in that blue oval on which that plaque sits, you've got at the top, Wes Wilson's art credit. And then in the bottom left, the printer's credit, West Coast Litho. So, it wasn't musicians on stage, but boy, a couple of beautiful examples of vintage, psychedelic poster art from the Dean of it all, Wes Wilson. And a couple of real beauties here to show you together from also just a perfect time, late 1966, when things were just beginning to hit their full stride. A couple of great posters from a great artist and a real gentleman, too. Thanks a lot for dropping by today. Great to show you these, and we'll see you again for something soon. Bye-bye.